What's up everyone? It's your girl Stephanie and today I have my holiday gift guide for y'all. I'm always very excited to film this video because I'm just sharing with you things that I own that I really like and that I feel like would be great gifts for other people. I try and find cool, useful things to show y'all. Please, if that is the case, let me know. I will make sure to link all my previous gift guides down in the description. I feel like they're all relevant still. Let's get started first with beauty products. Um, this video is in partnership with Current Body and we have this red light therapy mask. Even if this video wasn't sponsored by Current Body, I would be showing y'all this mask because it is such an innovative design. I feel like red light therapy has just come so far in the last few years. It really was only available at facials very recently, I feel like. And now you can do it yourself at home. So this mask has been proven to be the most powerful on the market. It is 31% more powerful than other LED masks. If you didn't already know, red and near infrared light therapy increases the production of collagen, calms redness, improves skin tone, boosts circulation. In the last year and a half or more, have been dealing with some pretty bad skin stuff, very much triggered by stress. It was eczema before, which caused my face, just my whole face to be so itchy, and then that made me break out a lot more and it was just this one thing after another. Right now, honestly, I'm kind of dealing with just a lot of hyperpigmentation and leftover scarring. My skin just doesn't seem to heal as quickly as it used to when I was younger. I mean, I'm 33 years old, so that makes sense. Essentially what this mask does is it reduces inflammation. So it helps the skin heal, it calms redness, it helps with wrinkles. It, I just feel like it does everything. I have a coupon code, so it is STEPHANIEVCB for 15% off this mask. I have two more items from Current Body to show y'all, which I also have codes for. So the next item we have here, this is the New Face Petite Facial Toning Device. So I actually have the larger size and I like this one so much more. So what this little device does is it helps to really carve out shape your face, which is crazy, but it uses microcurrents. This device encourages your muscles to contract and release, making them stronger. And it tells your cells to produce more collagen. You probably can't tell because of the lighting actually that's in my room, but you can see like instant results when you use this, especially under my jawline, I can tell. I only use this on the first level since I'm kind of starting back up using this again. Uh, so obviously like the further you go, you're gonna see a more drastic change. So for this new face device, I have a code Stephanie V N F. I feel like either one of these items, this mask or the new face would be great for any skincare enthusiast. I feel very lucky that I get to use both of these. Um, we have one more item here. This is the most like personalized one out of the three for sure. This is the smooth skin Pure. This is an IPL hair removal device. I did do so much research on IPL before. I went into like this, you know, deep dive hole in Google. Now I'm like stoked that I can try this out. It works by using intense pulse light to disable the growth of targeted hair follicles. So then over time with regular use, the hair follicles will die. Uh, leading to permanent hair reduction and removal. This is all done without damaging the skin. I talked about this before, like I've never gone to get waxed, but I've always been intrigued by something like maybe like laser hair removal. But again, I don't know, just the thought of going someplace to do it, like I just don't like it. So the fact that I can just do this from the comfort of my own home. Um, yeah, I'm excited to, really dive into it. If you're interested, I will keep y'all updated. I also have a discount code for this. It is Stephanie V S S to get this device for $275 from $399. If any of y'all have used IPL before, please let me know your experience because like I said, I went into like a deep dive and watched all these YouTube videos and I generally saw really, really positive things about this. I'll make sure, of course, to put all the discount codes in the description. I feel like they're pretty, <laughs> like really good discounts. Uh, so let's move on to the other beauty products now. Well, okay, I only have a couple items that are in the 
beauty genre or beauty adjacent, I guess. Um, this is from Diamond Drunk. It is a non-toxic plant-derived fine jewelry cleaner. If you're gonna wear some gold, you, you wanna make it look as beautiful as possible, I feel like. And it can also get really dirty. This is so awesome because I never really thought about the products, the solutions that I was using to clean my jewelry. This again is non-toxic, plant-derived. I don't think the other items, the other products that I was using was <laughs> doing anything good for the dermatitis on my fingers. You get this little kit initially. This container, this really nice, heavy glass dish. There are different scents that you can get. There's this little brush on the side. It doesn't actually come like this. I think you could just leave it inside, but I just glued this little hook that I made out of wire onto the side like that. You have this little tray here that you stick all of your jewelry in. You can do it nightly if you want. Just put all your stuff in there. In the morning, rinse it. You can even just do it for a few minutes if you want. You don't wanna put jade or softer stones in this solution. That also goes for like sterling silver. After initially getting this first kit, they can go ahead and just purchase the small concentrated solution and keep using this over and over again. I'm not somebody who collects a bunch of different fragrances and switches it up all the time. I know some people like combine things. Like I, I don't know, I'm so particular about how I smell. I was randomly in a Sephora. It caught my eye because I never go to the perfume section to be honest, to smell different perfumes. I guess I just saw it and I was like, oh, I really like the bottle. And I smelled it and it just, that was it. You know when it's just like, this is my scent and I had to get it. This is Burberry Goddess. Actually, what I got was this little baby bottle. <laughs> this is the first one that I got, okay? I was very surprised to find out when I looked this up online that this scent is just vanilla. It's three different kinds of vanilla. Fragrance, family, warm and spicy. Okay, and the scent type, warm and sweet gourmands. A person who enjoys eating and often eats too much? Like a glutton? If you like the Sol de Janeiro uh, Boom Boom Cream, that scent, you'll like this. Everyone who smelled this across the board has said it smelled really good. And I bring this up because one, if you have a friend who's a scent enthusiast, this is a great gift. And they have this little box set. This and this together. And then, honestly, this lasts me a long time. For $39, it's $51 value. So you get both of these. I thought it was a really cute little set. And um, I think it was like the VIB sale. I just decided to go ahead and get this size, which is 1.6 size. Speaking about scents, this is I think the first time that I'm ever going to include candles in my in my gift guide. It might just be because I wanted to show you my favorite candle. This is the Mason Louis Marie. I'm just gonna call it number four. Sandalwood Cedarwood Top Mid Vetiver Nutmeg Cinnamon Base Amberwood. To me this isn't one of those real woodsy scents. It is really fresh to me, very green. I feel like it has the kind of scent that you would get out of maybe like a diptyque, you know, when it was like really fancy candles, but the price point is good. 34 or $38 for the candle. It really fills the room. The scent is beautiful. They also have like a bunch of different ones. I just wanted to show you this company in general for really beautifully scented candles and perfumes. By the way, do you like my little fake fire back here? It's actually a heater. Uh, I've been wanting one of these for a long time and I got it on, what is it called? Woot? Have you ever heard of Woot? I don't know, a sister brand or is it owned by Amazon? And it has a bunch of like Amazon overstock. It's stuff that may be like available for a couple days only or until it sells out. And you can get things for so much cheaper. So I ended up getting this little fireplace guy that I've been researching, researching all these different ones and I got it for like 50 bucks cheaper than if I would just have gotten it on Amazon, like even on sale. So I had this like little space heater that broke and then I ended up getting this one in the fireplace just for some ambiance and I love it. If you have somebody 
who has a non-functional fireplace area, it's perfect. Or if you have it, you should get this. Seriously. Make sure to link Woot because I, <laughs> I have to stop looking at it because I just love scrolling Woot. I think this is the item that I left out of last year's on accident. And this is the Kodak Instant Dock Printer. This is for at-home photo printing. This is such a handy little guy, especially for when I'm trying to do things in terms of crafts. I made a couple necklaces, like the picture necklaces, or, you know, for like lockets, when you're trying to just print out a certain size. With this printer, with the app, you can reduce the size and figure out exactly what you need. I think this is also just a great thing to have yourself because you can create presents out of it, which I will show you in a second. I've gotten a lot of use out of this and I think it'd be a great present for anybody who loves snapping photos and who loves having, you know, lots of photos of your loved ones around. I just wanted to show you a couple frames that I recently got. My favorite thrift store right now is Savers. So organized, so clean. I love their home goods section because there's, I, I guess the one near my parents' house. Um, that's the one that I always go to because I go with my mom on Tuesdays. They have senior day. <laughs> we always go on Tuesdays. So, you know, we use her senior discount. Their home section is always so good. And I found so many beautiful frames. Frames are so expensive when you buy them new or you just get them from the store. Like you can get cheapo ones from Amazon or whatever. They're nothing special. Look how beautiful the tulips. And I think that this was like $3. <laughs> My favorite flowers are tulips, by the way. I also picked up just this little guy, this little silver frame here. I think I got it for like a dollar or something. I also got this glassware. You know somebody has a certain aesthetic, maybe they like cocktails or they just like displaying things. Check out the glassware at your local thrift store. I would say a set of four is always nice. I ended up also getting these little coops guys. I think they were like $2 something plus a month's discount. I always feel like glassware, home stuff is very thoughtful and it doesn't have to cost a lot at all. Go to your local thrift store savers, look at each individual item. I feel like sometimes when you do like a grand sweep, you're like, oh, nothing's here. But I almost missed like these glasses when I was doing that. And then I was like, okay, no, I need to sit here and like, like this glass, this glass. You gotta kinda like take your time a little bit and look at them individually. Sometimes things just kinda go over your head if you're not gonna really pay attention. If you do that, you're gonna find something cool. If you have a coffee enthusiast in your life, anything by Hario is wonderful. This is actually very similar uh, to a set that my sister and I got for my dad for his birthday or for Christmas. So here is my little Hario pour over pot. Beautiful, high quality. I think that if you're gonna purchase something like this, try and make sure to get them the filters. I feel like that's really thoughtful to get them both so they can obviously make a cup of coffee right away. There are people in your life who are coffee people and then don't really care about coffee people. So you know who those people are. They would have really love and appreciate something like this. I think my sister got the pots and maybe I got the kettle, but this is the Hario electric kettle. This is my electric kettle. I don't have another one outside of this. Yeah, this one I can use for everything. Oh, you know what? Something I left out. If you kind of wanted to elevate your candle gift, I'm not sure how the mic will pick this up. <laughs> one of these little guys. USB rechargeable lighter? Candle lighter? Sometimes just giving somebody a candle, it's so like, meh. You need to give them this, elevates it. You wanna elevate it even more, you can get them one of these little wick cutters. I got this as a gift and I really didn't think I was gonna use it, but I use it quite often. It's important to cut your wicks. <laughs> okay, I'm just gonna throw this one in because it's, it's probably the most random item <laughs> in this whole entire list. Yeah, it definitely is. This is a Chemical Guys wash and shine car cleaning kit. I wanted to include this because I feel like this is such a useful item. I didn't know how much the fluid or liquid used really mattered until I 
started living here and where my car is parked in the back, I have these huge trees over it and they it's just so much sap. My car is just riddled with sap and it just like kind of makes the whole hood black. I have used other things to try and clean it and it is so stuck on, but I read some reviews and I ended up buying this like Mr. Pink. So I had not really used the other, I hadn't used the other ones before, but this Mr. Pink solution, I put it in a foaming thing. I have this foamer, <laughs> sprayed it on my car and it just like wiped off. All the stickiness just came off the car. I know I just talked about my jewelry cleaning product, how it could be a little bit rough on my dermatitis. I will, I'll, I'll say I've used this Mr. Pink now three times. No matter what, when you're washing your own car, you can't protect, the water's gonna get in there somehow, and it's never irritated my dermatitis, surprisingly, because it, I feel like it's such a strong product, but I've never like had any breakouts or anything because of this product. But over um, Black Friday, I saw this at Walmart, and I was at my parents' and I wanted to wash my car at my parents'. So this has um, the Mr. Pink stuff, it has a wheel cleaner and an interior cleaner, which the interior cleaner is really nice. It makes all those like black plastic kind of pieces look shinier and nicer. But the other thing about this is obviously you get this bucket and it has this tray at the bottom. So um, all the sediment and kind of gross stuff settles at the bottom. And then when you're putting your little squeegee guy or whatever back in the water, it kind of prevents it from being all stirred up again. If you don't want to get the wash kit, they have like the wax kit and stuff. Now that I have washed my car with this stuff um, and I was like cleaning the center console, now I'm like, actually, I really want to get products to, yeah, like uh, the outside of my Jeep, those plastic parts are looking very dull. And I know you got to get like a specific product for that as well. I wanna make my car look nice and like upkeep it. I don't I don't want those pieces to start really fading and looking gross. So I know I have to take better care. But yeah, you got a car enthusiast, you know, I don't know like a gift for dad. I would like getting this gift if I didn't already have it. Let's do a couple like random electronics that I have here that I think are very, very useful. First off is this fabric shaver. It shaves all the little, little little balls that you'll get on your sweaters when they've been washed too much or improperly, like you shouldn't have put it in the wash, but you did. You use this thing and it just shaves all those little extra pieces off and your sweater, your blanket, your pillow will look brand new. Is this a common item that people generally have? I'm not sure actually. Let me know if this is something that you use in your house regularly. If you haven't gotten one of these yourself, go out, buy it, because you will want to pill. That's what it is. Oh my gosh. You will want to depill everything. All your knitwear, all your pillows, and your blankets and sheets, okay? Just like get this, and I think it's a great gift. Similar gift, I guess, is a little <laughs> handheld vac. Again, great for a car enthusiast, because I think this is uh, one that is really advertised as a car one because you have this little attachment here that can get in all the nooks and crannies. There are a bunch of attachments that you get with this one here. It's powerful. It holds a good charge. It's not that loud. I'm not gonna turn it on, but there's two settings and then there's a flashlight. There's like an SOS thing too. It has an attachment to like vacuum seal. If you have one of those vacuum seal bags for like your extra pillows and stuff. And also it is not just a vacuum. It is something that you can use um, like as compressed air. You can use it to like dust your keyboard. It's great for electronics, inflatable, pool toys, and also you can reverse it to deflate it as well. Jeeps definitely have some weird nooks and crannies because it is a car that you're supposed to <laughs> take apart, put back together. So there's places where things can drop. I just needed something this small to get all up in there. I have another one actually that I will try and find and link out. That one in itself has 
the compressed air attachment just permanently on there. So it is really geared towards if you wanna clean your keyboard and that kind of stuff. But the suction on that is super strong as well. I have used that other one so much. It just like kind of lives amongst my stuff, I'm always using it to clean something up. Uh, so just a little vacuum like this, I think is so useful for anybody. Okay, so now we've kind of come into like crafting corner. So these are things that are so useful for somebody who likes to like crochet or do anything like cross stitch. Honestly, any kind of craft. I've used, you know, those like little clip lights on the desk. Sometimes you don't want just like a bulb right in your face. You need something that is directional. This light right here, I'm so happy that I got it. I know it looks very intense. Okay, let me show you the base. So you can put this onto any table here. And then it has two LED bars. You can like switch up the direction individually. And obviously you can kind of play with the height and stuff. I didn't really realize how much my eyes were straining. With this light, I have this one kind of angled on the pattern and this one is more angled on my work surface itself and it's been such a game changer and it's not expensive. I know it seems kind of like weird, kind of random to give somebody something like this. I swear, if you have a crafter, a crocheter, knitter, it's really important that you're not doing something for so long that you're straining your eyes. I'm realizing that that's what I was doing. Um, so this has been so useful. And other than the light, this is actually advertised as more like a camping table, I guess. Before I was using um, like a TV tray. Now that I started using like these things, you know, I realized the surface area is so small and it's just so unsteady and wobbly. This has legs. From this company itself, I believe they just have two sizes. So uh, this is the smaller the size. I also ended up buying uh, a few months later the larger size, which actually is what my camera is on with a bunch of other stuff right now. But this one you have three different height options. Lap desk and then the next size would be kind of like a coffee table. Yeah, like coffee table height. And then the next one is kind of like normal TV tray height. Other thing that I love about this table too is that it has a lip around the whole table. With the TV tray, first of all, small, and then things just roll off of it so easily all the time. And because this has a lip, it gets caught on the lip, which is so, so nice. There are just so many things about this table that I could just keep talking about. The one bad thing I would say is with the larger of the two table sizes. So the larger one comes with a second set of legs. So you have two size options. This first one, I'm sitting at it on the ground. The second one is a normal dining room table height. So it, it's too tall to sit on my couch at least and work on it as a surface. So what I've been doing is using legs from this one on the larger size and then it's perfect. I would say the smaller one, just like start off with that one, I guess, if you're gonna do it. But again, if you have a crafter in your life, that table's a game changer. I love it so much. I guess the only like crafting item that I have here is this pot holder deluxe. It is a little loom. What it makes is these really adorable, really useful little pot holders. It comes with the loom. And then it comes with a bunch of different colors. Whoops. I actually did this. I just wanted to color coordinate it. I'm bummed because I don't have one to actually show you because I gave away two and then I think I have two more, but they're in the back house. Somebody's staying there right now, so I can't like go get them. And it also has all these like little designs. Super, super straightforward and great. Maybe you just buy it for yourself and make your family, your friends, some pot holders as gifts. I think this is also a great gift for like a younger person, maybe not a child, but somebody who's interested in these kind of crafts. And it's a great introduction to weaving. I would love to be gifted things for Josie. It's weird because I would feel bad to buy something for somebody for their dog, 
but not get it <laughs> for them as a person. But I would love to be just gifted something for Josie because that is a gift to me as well. Let me know what you think about that. Dog and cat people out there, somebody were to give you a gift and then it was like something for your dog. I feel like I'd be so stoked. Little Beast um, right now has so many cute little shirts and sweaters. Josie has been wearing this one a lot. It's a real muscle shirt though. She's so broad, so she's, she looks real muscly. A little rainbow one. I know they're very summery. I guess this one's deeper colors. Green and dark blue striped little shirt. I love this one too. It's kind of like these different colors. She really does love wearing clothing, by the way. It's not just me. Whenever I take one of these out, she's up there and she's like ready to put it on. This is the thing I really want to show y'all though, because this is such a beautiful collar. So Little Beast recently had a collaboration with Sandy Leong. So this is what they came out with. So we have little gold um, heart studs. It's just a really beautiful, high quality collar. Her other one, she has a brain dead collar and then she also has her hypnotic dog, necklaces and of course all day every day the hypnotic dog necklaces as well but this is just the recent purchase that i got her and i just feel like she looks so fancy and cute i did get josie one time like a studded collar like this but it was just regular studs and it it just kind of looked a little bit too intimidating and i didn't want her to look scarier for people who might be intimidated by her. From afar, maybe you can't tell the hearts, but I feel like the gold really warms it up and it makes it just look really sweet. So yeah, Josie's not here right now too because she's at the vet. So that's why she's not just like climbing all over me, by the way. All right, I think that's it for this year's gift guide. Yeah, I think I got everything. Again, I know it's like really random stuff, but I really like all these things. So hopefully these are things that you would enjoy that you would like to give please let me know if that is the case i guess let me know if it's not the case too but let me know if any of these things caught your eye of course everything will be linked in the description box along with all the discount codes that i have for the current body items i'm honestly so stoked to have this now along with the new face and the ipl device that i'm gonna be using I hope I gave you a, a good range of items, giving gifts and getting, receiving gifts, super fun. But obviously the most important thing is to just be around your loved ones and let them know that you appreciate them. That's obviously what this is all for. So verbalize that as well. I have to be better at that. Um, but yeah, I'm very thankful for all of you. Thank you for watching this video and for being with me. And I'll see you in the next one. Bye.